It's the AG and Nana show. Started off as friends, now we all we know. The love grows, it all started from hello. And we in this forever, we'll never be saying adios. I'd like to welcome you to AG and Nana show. Hey guys, what's good with the AG and Anna gang? We back with another banger. You know, I gotta watch my language around this one now. Before we get into today's video, make sure you guys leave a like, comment, share, and... Make sure you to subscribe, man. If you're new to the channel, man, hey, welcome to the AG gang. You know what it is. We lit terribly by... Tell me fire content. If you already been here, you know we locked in for like. Make sure you guys go follow us both on Instagram and make sure you guys go follow our TikTok. And make sure you guys go follow Miss Thing right here on her Instagram too. Because she will be posting some pictures on her Instagram every <laughs> every so often. Probably more than for sure. More than me. <laughs> Probably more than us. <laughs> so make sure you guys go follow her Instagram. As you guys can tell by today's title, and if you guys aren't new to our channel, then you know. We have a son, not a human son. Our first son, Bear. Well, he <laughs> he can be considered a human son because yeah. like, some honest shit. He he weighs more than a lot of humans. He 155 pounds. He weighs more than me. <laughs> By like 30 pounds. So. Well, before pregnancy. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna show you guys how Bear gets acquainted with the baby and how he is around her. When we found out we were pregnant and stuff, we're like, oh my gosh, like I can't wait to see Bear around her. Oh my gosh, she's gonna have a little sister. But of course, like he's never seen a baby before, so well, like I said, we'll get into that. But it was all new to him, so stay tuned if you guys are interested in that. And then. Um, I don't know if you, if you guys watched our previous videos and you know like we had a lot of family in town We literally had family in town for how many days like man family got here February 21st. Yeah, and The last like the last wave of family I guess you would say left on March 12th. So if you think yes. about it, we didn't have family here for about 21 days 22 days something like that either way we ain't got no food in the crib, so we buy go grocery <laughs> we store. We gotta go to the grocery store, so we gotta go stock up and do that because our family was obviously feeding us. And if you guys are new to our channel, we had family here because we're originally from Ohio. Our family lives in Ohio, and we moved to Las Vegas, so obviously they came out here for the arrival of our baby. So yeah, we, we bear up in this crib. We gotta go hit the grocery store, and we're gonna bring yeah, you guys man. with and us. Stay, I was about to say stay tuned because it's gonna be our first time, you feel me? But just as going to the grocery store with a newborn baby. Yeah, also. just grocery shopping with her. We've been to the store with her, but like we said, we've had a lot of family in town. So, like, we've always been doing something with someone yes. else. So, honestly, these past few days have really just been our first time of, like, just us three as a family at home. We will just show y'all how they vibe around around each other, the newborn baby and our 150-pound dog. So we're just going to show y'all that, man. Other than that, man, shit's still the same, AG gang. You know what it is. Besides Anna making me, I got a little smoke room now. She don't really let me blow around the whole crib, which is cool. As I, I should. I understand. As you should. I'm in the back seat now instead of the front with babe. Say hey, babe. <laughs> I moved from a passenger princess to back seat queen with the princess <laughs> so this will definitely take some getting used to aaron's gonna be the designated uber from now on <laughs> not too much though not too fucking much my baby does not want to listen to this my baby does not want to listen to that bullshit yeah. Turn on some lullabies. All right. Let me turn on some lullabies. Turn on that Janae Aiko uh, sleep sound for the baby. She don't want to listen to that. She does. She, she loves that. Listen to what she listen to That's how she goes to sleep. Babies want to listen to what they listen to in the womb. And yeah, and all she heard was bang, bang, some boom, good, boom, yeah, pop, some, pop. That's why she sleep right now. Guys, it is so nasty outside right this now. This is rare. Like, it hardly ever rains here in Vegas, but it is looking like... Of course, the day we want to go out with the baby it looks it's looking like who did it what for and why and there's no yeah, we're like, from ohio so we used to this shit ew, but that's why we moved out actually i do like when it rains here it's like a vibe so it makes it has me salty that we left the house because i'd much rather just be in the house we ain't gotta go full grocery shopping we get to be on some quick shit quick shit we gotta be on some quick shit with the baby but honestly guys she's really good out like whenever we leave the house hopefully i'm not 
jinxing us right now but anytime we leave with her she is like the best baby she be knocked out the whole time she don't be bothering nobody so fingers crossed this is grocery shopping with a baby she's in here and then aaron's over there with another cart we're kind of just going up and down the aisles we're we on some random age hey, we're going crazy though we, we are super crazy. random right now. We gotta get the body on. We got the juices, part. that's for sure. And you know, you're not done yet. Come on, come on. We always like to go to self checkout, you know, so we can steal some shit. <laughs> no, I'm playing. Why you say I'm just playing? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm fucking hey. Yeah, I'm playing. Mind your damn motherfucking business, bitch. <laughs> Little stupid bitch. Don't steal. <laughs> Shut up. You're so loud. You're so loud, shut up. You get in charge for being a broke nigga. Bro, come on. This is for my baby. Why is your daddy lying on you already? She's knocked out. Hers is sleeping. I'm putting y'all on real quick. If you do soft tacos, do the bowls. I think you told them that before, babe. Yeah, listen though, that's the damn problem. <laughs> babe, there's this uh, I there's this quote. It said, "The first nigga that ever lied to me was my lying ass daddy," or some shit like that. <laughs> she ain't got worry about that. You already just lied on her. Why are you lying? Look at little Miss Crybaby over here. <gasps> little Miss Crybaby. Babe. Yeah, man, she having a baby is just you know, like, uh, can't even put the groceries up. <laughs> I literally came right in the door, started breastfeeding her, sat right on the couch, took my sweater off, and yeah, she seemed content, but now she's waking up. She's like, get the camera on my fucking face. Get the motherfucking camera on my fucking face, nigga. So we finally got her to go to sleep. This is her spot where she likes to sleep. We're going to try to get away from drinking pops because we have been drinking pop lately. But we're definitely going to stop. So we got this right here. If you guys haven't tried this, man, go try it. White what is it called peach. again, babe? White cran peach. White cran peach. Super so smart. good. Love me some apple juice. We're getting Gotta away from the pops. We're doing water and straight juices. Yeah. And I love water too, so that's not a problem. Chips. We got some... Spicy sweet chili, these are really good. Salt and vinegar, Kroger brand salt and vinegar, you know what I'm saying? And then a Kroger brand barbecue chips. It gets the job done just as good. Can't go wrong with the body armor, man. Can't go wrong with the body armor. You just throwing that shit in there any kind of way, but I'm gonna organize it after we turn the camera off. Oh, I love my strawberries. Can't so go wrong with strawberries. strawberries, and then, I don't know if, maybe I'm weird, but I like to dip my strawberries in yogurt. So, I got, these two things of yogurt. This is my favorite yogurt. Every time we go to the grocery store too, we always grab, we always grab these two because we know we can use them as a side with well, whatever dinner. Don't play though, because if y'all real supporters, then y'all know if y'all go watch our Thanksgiving vlog, we make we put we put the foot in the mat. Yeah, we can make don't get it twisted. Cheese, we can make play. real mac, but that ain't for the everyday weekday. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. We're on a healthier shit, so we're gonna start eating more salads, some grapes, more fruit. Salads. I always buy grapes. So you did grab more hot sauce. He tried to say he didn't need none. So Aaron cannot live without his hot that. sauce. And then when we make tacos, that. hot and you spicy. If you can live without that red hot, then I don't even know. Y'all already know, I'm a Tibetan. So. Got a big thing of oranges because why not? Oranges are just really good and you can always snack on them. And Bear likes oranges too. Broccoli, and you see we got the salmon. No, I don't drink regular milk. We don't drink regular milk, so we going with the almond silk milk. Anna loves Lucky Charms. You feel me? I like a couple different cereals, but today I went with the Honey Bunch of Oats just because I am on my healthier tip and these actually slap. One of my favorite snacks, you gotta take the pepperoni with the cheese, like a charcuterie board type shit. I like to make it myself though. Take the pepperoni with the cheese with some rich crackers, slap. But we gonna get back to y'all once we get everything put up. We wanna give a special shout out to Halista Pet. Shout out her list of pet, you know what yes, it is. Yes, they be hooking our fur baby up. Hey, okay, let me hey, tell they you. They trying to get the fur baby like, like daddy, you know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> me and Bear into the same things, if you know what I mean. Her list of pet CBD gummies, five milligrams of each gummy. 
Of course, you got to look at the instructions. If they're under 50 pounds, it'd be a certain amount of chews over. Mm -hmm. Bear's a bigger dog, so we do tend to give him more. But CBD, just like for humans, just for our fur baby, like Anna said, and this is actually like great for him. As you guys know, we live across the country, so it's just us. So mm -hmm. as you can imagine, bringing a baby home, and then you got Anna's family coming here, or my family, whoever it is, we got family here, people he hasn't seen in years. Basically, when we have people come over, he doesn't get aggressive, but he tends to, Bear has an anxiety, so yeah. you'll see him painting, he'd just be walking all over the place, so. But she doesn't normally act like that. But she doesn't normally act like, but I mean, it's anxiety, he, he's not used to being around people, so he gets nervous, so you could give him a couple of CBD gummies, and uh, relax him, chill him right out, family, mm -hmm. friends will be over, he'll be laying over there on the floor, or he'll be chilling over there behind the gate. And you guys know too, we got Bear during like COVID, so he is a COVID puppy, he was with us all the time, Thanks. literally all the time, and we worked from home, so like, he was always used to being with us. So when we started to go back outside, he was kinda on some like, hold up, y'all leave me by, my, by myself. Oh, yeah. So basically when he's here by himself, we'll let him eat a few, and you know, just relax him, calm him down, like mommy and daddy are gonna be back, it's okay. <laughs> Even though he's a big monster looking dog, He's literally our big baby. And don't get it twisted. These are CBD gummies that are meant for dogs. Halista mm -hmm. is a great brand because it's meant for dogs. So it ain't like you're just giving your dog some edibles and he over right. there. <laughs> they have different products for different kinds of animals depending on what kind of pets you guys mm -hmm. have. They do have a lot of different products, you know, in this CBD realm. So make sure you guys go check them out. Like I said, they don't just have stuff for dogs. And not only do they have CBD products, they also have like fresh breath, like oh, yeah, muscle okay. support, joint support, joint support, all that good stuff. Which, you know, big dogs got bad joints or they tend to get bad joints as they get older. I just want to shout out Halista Pet again for getting bare right. Like they didn't came through, got his breath fresh. They didn't came through, made sure his joints was on point and now they making sure his anxiety is, you feel me, at a lower level if family or friends do come over. So if you guys have pets and you want to treat them like this special luxury pets that they are, your pets deserve to be treated like humans too. So make sure you guys go shop Halista Pet down below. Introducing a dog to a newborn, you know, it, it's all about boundaries and just patience, like the first day and just understanding. Every dog is different, but small things, like for example, we got a gate right here. It ain't like he gonna bite the baby, but you just wanna be safe. So this is just one of those things where we got this just for boundaries or say if I'm not here or say if Anna and me just wanna have the baby on the ground or things like that. So for me, Bear's a good dog, but this was a gate that we just bought. It's a nice gate too that we just, so we could separate them sometimes. He got a lot of room down there. He got this landing up here. He got another landing down there. Look at him down there laying down. Yeah, so Bear likes his little area. You see he down there chilling. He like, who, why are you talking about me? Bear it's what? Actually because it's colder. <laughs> we got a balcony, so we put him on the balcony. We let him roam free too. But just to show you guys, because the boundaries, now look at him. Let me let him in. We'll let him in. Jimmy, he may have sniffed a car seat. He do love his bear, little bear. sister. Is she high? He looking for her. Where is she? Where is she at? Okay, Where is okay, she? okay, okay. I know, I know. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know. As you guys know, this gate wasn't here before, which we never intended to put a gate here because obviously the body mirror is here. But it actually, it goes well, and Bear likes this little area. And, and honestly, we should have got it. A long yeah, time ago it even works out for you guys because some of our videos y'all bear be interrupting them bear be doing this what bear are you doing them, stuff like that so it works out for the best so we could just separate them let's just go ahead and show them how he acts with the baby the bear's baby sister sit good boy good, good boy he's a good dog for the most part so i could bring her down here we're just basically teaching them not to lick because you never you don't want the her breaking out because his because tongue. the bear's nasty, yeah. So he is protective over her when we had family here. Depending on which family member it was, I think he could he sense leave. like yeah, who was scared of him and who wasn't. Leave. Like he's not leaving by yeah. her side. Around us, he's more chill. But when family members were here, that's really the real reason we got the game. Okay, Sid, you want to see your sister? Oh, look at your sister. You see hers? <laughs> oh no, no licking, Sid. Oh yeah, lay down. Ooh, her binky fell up. Lay down. Okay. Good boy. You Good boy. Hers? You see your sisters? Yes. Okay. Don't be. Don't licks though. Okay. No licks. No licks. No. No licks. 
No, no, no licks. See your sisters. Aww. See your sisters? No licks, though, just sniffs, okay? <laughs> he, he's still a big baby at heart. Bear's like, hold up, I'm the baby. Okay, okay, so to, Bear sum, still gets to sum it up, too. to sum it up, Bear hasn't changed. He loves his sister. Of course, we've tested and like kept in the car seat. He causes no harm to her. Of course, we'll always watch her. You can never be too sure. If anything, he'll try to lick her. That's why we separate him a little bit right now, just so he doesn't lick her. His protectiveness went up higher than I, I didn't even think it already could. Now, like now, if we're in here and somebody knocks at the door. Too, if it's just me and the baby here, like say Aaron's not here, he goes crazy at the door. I thought he went crazy before. Nah, he really goes crazy now. Okay, so let's But Hims is just a big let's sweet see, boy Let's see a protection still. test, okay? Let's go. What we're gonna do right now, man, we're gonna see if Anna's holding the baby. I'm gonna act like I'm gonna hit the baby. You guys ready? Hi, pretty. Hello. Hi. Back up a little bit, baby, so I oh, can it's see okay. you. It's okay. okay. It's okay, mommy's baby. That little baby right there, I'm about to... Bear, your sister? I don't give a... You think that's your sister? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bear is not I'm going. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. Good boy. It's okay, Bear. It's Good okay. Boy. Daddy just joked. He was just showing. He was just showing people. Now, if Anna he flinches at me it. like that, if Anna flinches at me like that, Bear does nothing. He's a protective doggy. But here's the one thing about Bear. You feel me? He's a, he's a fatty, so he's food motivated. So he doesn't care what you got going on if you got one of these. He don't care about nobody's baby. He don't care about me. He don't care about y'all. If you got one of these, how he act with one of these? Show him, babe. Look at his legs right now. Bro, Lena, get up. <laughs> no, no, sit. No, I didn't mean, I didn't mean up, sit, Paul. Good lay down. boy. Good boys, okay. Good boy, oh, him just taking his bone to town. And we usually give him his bone outside just because it makes a mess, but he loves these. This is his favorite thing in the world, probably. Yeah. If we give him one of these, He's guaranteed occupied for three, four hours outside, maybe five oh, He hours. won't bother nobody. Paul, slow. He'll take a slow, slow, slow. Good, Good boy. boy. He's trying to go in the gate. <laughs> go go, outside. go outside. outside, outside. Outside. Good boy. As y'all can see, he's protective over his sister. We'll always supervise him. Sometimes we separate it with the gate. Overall, man, same shit. We still turn. You know what it is, man. It's AG game. I feel like we a little family now. We got the dog, the baby, you feel me, shit like that. But I'm still, we still trying, we still trying to go further with this shit. So just stay tuned, man. We well, still, we still adjusting. We still adjusting. Still adjusting, if you know what I mean. If you know what I mean. If you know what I mean.